Hello everyone, welcome to the IchimokuCharts.com daily analysis for gold for Tuesday, December the 8th. Well, another negative day today with a very large red body candle and that's telling us that the sellers have made some very solid net bearish progress on the day. The market has uh, failed to um, find support at the uh, Kijun Sen, which was at 11.40 and has closed at 11.28. The bears are in control of this market and they're showing some very strong commitment to taking this market lower. The market is still in a first time frame downtrend and uh, the previous day we had a lower high and a lower low. Today we have an outside day with a higher high and a higher low. Um, that raises some doubt about the uh, um, potential for the first time frame downtrend to continue. But considering the short term dynamics with the bears being so strong, then um, uh, it's not likely that we will have a quick turnaround. Uh, we do need to realise that we have previously very strong upside price rejection from this region we had uh, we can see these shadows on the bottom of these candles and there was very strong buying coming in each time that the market uh, tried to trade down around this 1140 down to 1130 region the market has closed just within the end of that region with a very solid bearish close so the low of the current candle becomes very important for this market tomorrow if the market um uh, does uh, continue to trade down below there, then there is potential for the market to con continue trading down to the 1100 region. And um, there is potential for the market to trade much lower towards the uh, uh, bottom, uh, top of the cloud of the Kumo, which is around the 1040, 1050 region. Now, the market is still trading up above the cloud or the Kumo, which means that overall the market does have a positive bias. But uh, with the close outside of the Kijun Sen and the Tenkan Sen, the market is uh, very weak and uh, bearish in the medium and short term time frame. So there has been a very uh, strong bearish sell off. Looking at this other indicator over here that's called the Chiku Span, that it, it is simply the um, uh, current close of the market uh, projected back 26 periods and the use of that is to simply compare where that is trading at the moment to where the market was trading where the market is trading at the moment compared to 26 periods ago so the market is tr still trading up above that level which means that the market is still bullish so there is a, a mixture of um, bullish and uh, bearish uh, factors that we need to consider here um, in the longer term time frame the market is still positive and bullish but in the shorter time frame, the market is showing some weakness and we need to look to uh, uh, potential areas uh, for support for this market. Uh, the market will eventually find support um, uh, if the market does continue trading down. If it finds support here, we need to look to the short-term dynamics, look for any bullish uh, signals coming for a potential uh, long trade. Mm -hmm.